All right, everyone, and um, this is Stammeron, and welcome to to the channel that's all about stammering, stuttering, and everything in between. Um, so I've been stammering, f and we were worried I wasn't going to stammer. <laughs> <clears throat> I've been stammering for most of my life, and, and something I've realised that in the decades of experience and that I have. And like, is that like kind of stammering is something which people A like kind of think they know a lot about and B like, also have a lot of questions which they want to ask and um, however they're really nervous to ask them because they're afraid that they're stupid questions. So for this video I've invited all of my friends to ask me a stupid question. I have A collection of questions here which I have gathered from Facebook um, and I'm gonna answer some of them today just to give you a bit more idea like about like a, what is stammering and why does this channel matter what is the difference between stammering and stuttering uh, there isn't one <laughs> I'm like there is no difference and like it's just like kind of two words which mean exactly the same thing um, and the words I'm like kind of stuttering um, is more American and um, so therefore like, as a result like it's the one that's spoken more throughout the world and um, like whereas as I'm like kind of stammering like it's is more British. Um, like, I will admit that like, I tend to use um, um, I can stammer more, like, hence the name of this channel. I will sometimes say stutter, I'll switch it up, I will catch you by surprise and we'll have fun with it. Um, and I prefer stammer as a word because I think it sounds nicer in my accent which is very vain um, like, because of stammer versus stutter. And, like, stutter um, like, it just sounds it sounds like I'm grunting, so therefore, that's yeah, that's why I prefer first time. Like, however, like when I was younger, um, I used to think like that, like there was a difference between stammering and stuttering. I used to think, and that like kind of stammering, and like, it's more like kind of blocks, which is what I do. Um, whereas, um, whereas. And like kind of stuttering like is more like of the kind of porky peg like kind of stereotypical like kind of repetition one however as i grew older i discovered that that wasn't the case but i still like it as a story so you've got your repetition um and this is um like kind of when you do the kind of b -b 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 baby um but you can also have I can't say this word. I can also have a prolongation stammer. Um, and this is when like, you kind of like elongate the first sound like, in the word. So you might go baby. And like you can have that like, straight like kind of block. This is what I have. Speak of the devil and it arrives. Um, like, and basically like what a block is. And it's like I know like exactly what I want to say, but somewhere between here and here, it's getting trapped. It's not coming out. So there are like lots of different types of stam hurts, like, even beyond like these three types. And like, so, like if you're talking to someone like and they say like that they stammer, like, and you're like, oh I don't know, like it doesn't seem like a stammer. I would just trust that they know more about it than you do, um, and I would take them at their word, and I would just accept. If they say, like, oh, I have a stammer, they probably have a stammer. Um, and, and with like, every type of stammer like, as well, there's also... And there's also some like kind of secondary behaviour. And, and this is stuff... Stuff like with me, like where like my mouth twitches and like it can be people like kind of closing their eyes or losing eye contact and we're kind of kind of by looking away um like or 
call it any kind of facial movement which goes with the stammer. And that as well, like that's a completely like a normal part of the stammer as well. That's just part of the whole package, which is lovely. What is the cause of stammering? Like, what makes it happen? What brings it on? And like, because of the media, and one of the main assumptions is, um, is um, looking at that, that we stammer because we're nervous. And if we weren't nervous, then we wouldn't stammer. That's rubbish. But a stammer is not caused by nerves, it's not caused by high emotion. Um, however, like, a stammer like, is made like a little bit worse by nerves or high emotion. Any kind of spike in emotion, any like adrenaline, and um, whether it's excitement or fear or anything like that, like it can make our stammer worse. However, like it's not the cause. Um, what is the cause? We think we know. We're not sure yet. Um, like, there's a few possibilities um, on what might like cause stammering. Um, like the most like a recent research um, appears to suggest that it is neurological and that there's something in our brains that either isn't linked up correctly or it's just like a different and like from like kind of fluent people's brains um, and, it's, and it's actually like a really interesting like I took part like in a study recently like where like somebody like have scanned my brain like while they were making me do like, various like speaking tasks and, and then afterwards like he showed me the footage and of and of my brain like side by side like with like, a fluent person's brain and like, and like the areas of the brain like which were lighting up were completely different and it was just really fascinating because it was like oh Okay, so like it's not just here, it's definitely here as well. Um, which I think is really, really interesting. And yeah, like, I'd love to learn more about that. And maybe we can on a future episode. Um, and another one like of like the main like of the main like kind of causes like kind of which people talk about like is the fact that like a stammering is hereditary, um, like, to a certain extent. And um, I know people um, like, who like, kind of come from like, a long line of people who stammer. Like, his mum stammers, like, her mother stammered, her father stammered. Um, like, and there's been like, kind of papers where like, kind of twins who stammer, like, they're more likely to stammer. Like, if the other one stammers. So there's definite proof um, like, that there is some sort of, um, like, kind of like, genetic um, kind of link to it. However, not for everyone. Because... <laughs> as far as we know, I am the only person in my family who stammers. So therefore, what's happened here? Where does this come from? We don't know. <laughs> and, and and that's another thing that fascinates me about stammers is that they make no sense. Like, I'm... I've heard so many stories about like, oh, like a stammering is genetic. It must be his red Look at all this evidence. And then like, I rock up and I'm like, oh, I'm the only one who stammers in my family. And they're like, crap. <laughs> Back to the drawing board. We're not sure anymore. <laughs> so, and so like a long story short, like what's the cause of stammering? We don't know yet. Maybe once we know, like, it might mean that like, we can do more. At the moment, like, we're having a jolly good time trying to find out. <laughs> and uh, if there are, like, any developments, then I may cover them on the channel. <laughs> so we'll see. <laughs> this is part one of this series. Um, however, there's already been like, a lot of questions coming in. So therefore, like, I think we're going to do more parts. I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Like, and if you liked it, then please like, kind of like and comment and subscribe. Like, and let me know like what you want to see on this channel. And if you have any questions of your own, then please leave them down below as well.